Greetings, travelers, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Golden Sun, presented by Draco Breach. Now, you may notice that we are no longer in the inn, and there is a very good reason for that. I actually left town to grind up some coins so that I could buy new weapons for Isaac and Garrett. I've already bought Isaac's new weapon, so we're about to buy it for Garrett. So we go to over, over here, we want to buy the Battle Axe, and the reason why, 48 to 58, 10 whole extra damage. Now there wasn't much of a point in getting this before we fought, uh, fought the bandits, so I didn't. And we're going to go ahead and equip it, and we are going to sell the longsword. And give that to him. Now, you may also remember that last time, we got a new item. Specifically, the bandit sword. As we can see, it's very weak. In fact, it's weaker than the longsword. However, it says something here. It says, Light Blade unleashes rapid smash. Now, this sword is actually an artifact, and we do want to hold on to it for the time being. It's not going to stay with us too terribly long, but it is a good weapon for, well, you can guess. <laughs> you can guess, I'm sure. I, I was going to show something off, and what do I do? I leave town. Anyway, uh, mayor's house right up here and we want to talk to the mayor who is this guy yes allow us to show your you our gratitude like we promised and water of life that will come in handy are you heading out for the goma range by any chance yeah we are how do you know look for a cave in the mountains of the goma range northeast of us once you've passed it, you'll reach Bill Billabin. Okay, so not where I meant to go. Items: Water of Life revives down characters. Yeah, that's going to come important, come in handy because uh, Golden Sun is not easy. Uh, another thing that I was going to show off. Hopefully, we can get there easily enough. We can. Yes, we can. Okay, get out of the way is going to be this right here. Yeah, you see the Jin over Ginny over there, right? Well we can't do anything with that Ginny. Because we can't get over there. So unfortunately for now we are actually having to turn down a secret because we can't access it. And we don't have access to I, I, Isaac, no, Ivan's mind read at the moment either, so that's a shame. Um, not what I meant to do. Synergy, can't show it that way. Status. You'll also notice that I got up to level 6 while getting all those coins. Um, Isaac learned Spire, which is a one-target spell, so it's going to be pretty powerful. And Garrett learned... Uh, flare wall. I, yeah, flare wall. So, yeah, new spells to show off at some point. So, um, up north there is actually some stuff, but we are going to ignore that for now because it is hard. Um, we're also going to ignore that bridge and head over a little bit further than this. But, yeah, we are taking these things out a lot faster, and they're hardly doing any damage to us. Only reason I'm leaving that in is just to kind of show what those two levels did, and what the battle axes are doing for us. However, Goma Cave Entrance, there is going to be some useful stuff for us in here. Get across here. We can use the move synergy on that if we wanted to, but yeah, no point right now. It uses... I am right. We do need to use the move synergy on this, though. To pull it back so that we can walk straight across. 
Now this area is going to be pretty basic, um, and we're going to notice that we can't actually do anything here, so we use move, and nothing happens. We can't do anything. So we have to give up. It's no use. Our synergy isn't strong enough to free that stump. Oh, hello, Ivan. You want to move the stump, right? It looks like it's trapped in the ivy. Isn't there anything we can do? I know. I have a great idea. Leave it to me. Whirlwind. Well, isn't that convenient? I did it. Thanks for the help, but why are you here, Ivan? I couldn't get into Lunpa. Don't get me wrong, I didn't come here to ask for your help. Your quest has been on my e mind ever since I left Vault. Remember, I read everything that happened in your minds? I couldn't just leave, not with all these terrible things happening. If I can't rescue Master Hammett, then I want to help you. Please, allow me to join your quest. And Ivan has joined the party, and this time he will not be leaving. Are you trying to get to, to Bilibin through this cave? Then let's go. Okay, so, yeah, there's a reason that we kept that I item, uh, which is on Garrett. So, give it to Ivan, and ooh, look at that. A nice little increase in his uh, power. Um, he does have the Shaman's Rod, which doesn't actually do anything, unfortunately. I kind of wish it was an artifact like the Bandit uh, Sword, but yeah, yeah, you're, you're not that lucky. Um, move, so we can move this now. Right into the waterfall. I think there... I don't think there's anything there. Um, always worth checking. Nope, nothing there. Okay, so... Into Goma Cave. But as you can see, there's... Okay, come on. Okay. Come on. There's more... Stuff to get out of the way here. So... Get it out of the way. I, ooh, I want to say that... Right, I knew there... Okay, there is something that we can do. Um, <laughs> we actually want to go back to Vault. Right quick. Because there is actually something there. That we can do. Unfortunately, it's kind of easy to avoid enemies. Because if you stick to the path, pretty much the enemy encounter rate is low. Once you go into the forest... Or onto, or, or directly off the path. Go figure. But, um, I'm going to keep this battle in just in case Ivan uses... Wait, wait, I'm doing, I'm thinking about this wrong, aren't I? No, okay. It is random. Oh well, when Ivan uses the um, effect, I will leave that in. Okay, so behind the item shop. Behind the... Going too far, we'll leave. Um, wait. Read these notes again. Check. 
check behind the weapon shop. Oh! It would help if I read correctly. It's all the way back to Vale. <laughs> so, yeah. I'll cut out the trip back to Goma Cave. Um, but we're going back to Vale. And we are going behind the weapon shop to get something. I, I knew there was something else. So we're clearing away this. To actually get something that we're going to use pretty much immediately. Power bread. This is something I want to use for a very good reason. Because it permanently increases the max HP of a character. And yeah, Ivan, poor guy. Your HP is pitiful. I am tempted to use that mint, but at the same time, I'm tempted to save it. So, give me one moment, we will be back at Goma Cave. Okay, back at Goma Cave, we just go on in. Now, there's not too much to worry about in here. There are uh, three new enemies that we will be going over, but no big deal. Um, remembering the path in here. Oh, and already we have both the ghost and the skeleton. So, yeah, <laughs> this is going to be interesting. Uh, let's see if I can... The ghost is going to be weak to wind, so that's good for Ivan. Skeleton to earth. So, mixture there. Um, let's go ahead and use Spire on the skeleton. Have Garrett uh, show off Lair Wall so that we have that. And I, I'm still trying to get the attack out of Ivan, so let's do this. And he's not going to activate it. So, oh well. Impair. That could be. No problem, okay. Okay, so, continuing on. Ignore that for now. I don't, I'm pretty sure there's no treasure chests. And, ooh, a little bit more difficult. Um, this time, let's show off Ivan's Whirlwind. Since these guys are weak to wind, let's do it this way. Ah, uh, probably not a good idea, actually. And not a single one of them died. Wonderful. Oh, great. Defense drop. Shouldn't be too hard. As we can see, Ivan is very quick. And Eric is very... Ooh. Critical. Oh, I should not have had them all attack. Now they are all defending. Oh, wow, I'm going to have to actually heal pretty quick here, aren't I? These guys can be pretty powerful and fortunately dropping a lot of coins. Okay, so yep, nothing that we can do there. And now that I'm thinking about it, let's go ahead and use herbs on... Not as low as I thought it was. Looks bad, but it's not nearly as bad as I thought it was, so. Oh, and it finally activates. Rapid Smash. He hits him multiple times to deal a little bit more damage. Ivan leveled up to level 5. Nice. No skills, though. Wait. Uh, speaking of skills... Put that back on shortcut. Uh, mm -hmm. and continuing on, we go over here. Yeah, we want to move this right here, and we'll see why in a moment. Um, 
and a new enemy. Nice, the Willheads. Now these guys are going to be um, weak to Earth, like a lot of things apparently. Um, I think I have enough synergy points. Let's go ahead and Let's do that. So, let's see how quickly we can take out these will heads with a little bit of earth. Holy cow. You had to attack Ivan. Um, let's go ahead and cure. Or not. He should be fine for a little while. Yeah, there's a person to talk to. As you can see, there's also a fire gym. Did you see something strange over there? I I fought it, but it fled. When I returned, I saw it again. I wonder if it likes this place. And that is a bit of a hint, actually, to what you need to do. And that was a bit of a hint as to what you need to do, because that uh, Jinny is there for you to fight. <laughs> and yeah, there's that. Anyway, now that we are about halfway through with Goma Cave, this will be Draco Breach reporting out. God bless and safe travels.